Good morning, you guys. It's now the next day. I just finished getting ready for the day. Kaizi, tell everyone what happened to us before on our walk. What happened when we were on our morning walk? What? What did we get caught in? The rain. <gasps> We got caught in the rain. It just started pouring and Alfie doesn't like the water. So he's running along and shaking it off of him, nearly tripping me over. It was just a bit of a wild morning, wasn't it? Is that a but we're good morning, my boy. Did you have a good sleep? Do you want to go for a walk? Do you want to go for a walk? You want to go for a walk? Let's go. <laughs> what are you doing, bud? Saving centipedes. Saving centipedes? Show me. Oh, he's going to be very happy. Okay, you want to pop him in the grass? Mm -hmm. Good boy. Good job. Don't live to see another day. And I always catch centipedes. I know. But we're all ready. Yeah. What is that? Oh, it's a bit of card. It does look like band-aid. It's not band-aid. It's a bit of cardboard on the ground. Um, we've got Poppy's birthday today. So that'll be fun. We're going to go around there in a sec and visit him, have some morning tea and some friends are coming around too. So that'll be good. So we're going to get this present organized. Oh yeah, I didn't tell you guys about last night. I had dinner and trivia out with work friends and it was so much fun. I haven't done that in a long time. And I'm like, I need to do that more often. Even do like a date night with Tones and go to trivia or do something. It's just fun to get out and do something different. But yeah, it was really good, but I was so tired. What time did I get home? I think it was around 9.30. So not too late, but I was just out of it so i had an early night i sound like such an old grandma but i'm gonna get the card organized and oh get the kids to write it too this is what we got my dad we got him just a visa gift card and then this little card <laughs> we thought he was pretty cool he's kind of like reflective and sparkly so kaisi wants to be the first to write in poppy's card are you gonna draw him a picture? Yeah? Okay. Of me. Of you? What of you and him together? What are you gonna be doing? Uh, holding hands. Nice! You'll love that. Wait, do you start off the head first? Because I usually start off the head first. You can start with whichever part of the body you like. I'm not very good at doing heads. I think that looks like a pretty good head. Is that you or is that Pop? Uh, that would be me. <laughs> <laughs> no. They're holding hands. Like what do you think of this? Best friends. You can put some ears on there. Yep. I, I like doing elf ears though. You like doing elf ears? <laughs> You're cute. That's a big ear. <laughs> <laughs> some hair? Yep. Could I have some hair? Where are your legs? I'm going to colour the ears. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta do eyes and nose wow. and mouth. Where are you? Good job. They're that done. looks amazing. Now you gotta write your name above you and write pop next to his. I I know how to write pop. I'm gonna write pops first. Okay. P O P P O P Pop. Good job. Show us your little masterpiece. That looks amazing. Mm. Pop's gonna love that. Good job, buddy. Half five. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> that was a very gentle one. Boop. <laughs> You're funny. Look at 
you, Miss Cutie. This looks so nice and warm. Okay, can you please write the card? What are you doing, Kaizy? <laughs> Don't lick on my hand, Groceroonie. <laughs> Groceroonies. You're silly. Okay, can you go pop your shoes on? Are you going to wear your new shoes? Because they hurt me. That's because you didn't have the tongue right. You know, you got to pull the tongue around. Yeah, but it goes off though. You just got to do them up tighter. That way the tongue stays there. <gasps> you put the new shoesies on. They look good. Do they feel all right? Woohoo! Wow, they're so cool. Uh -oh. All right, good job, girls. Nicely done. All right, so we'll pop the little card in here. And we've got to run to the shop as well to see if we can get him some chocolate coated peanuts or chocolate licorice. Look at that, M and M's. Woo! There's something in the card. Thanks, <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, Cozy. <laughs> of course, Jack had to come to say happy birthday. Like snakes. <laughs> come and give us a cuddle. <laughs> hey, there you go. Good. Good. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. They don't want to come. Just you and I sing. Happy birthday to you. You should be around more than Jack, at least. Hip hip. Hip hip. Hip hip. Hooray. Hip hip. Hooray. 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 Okay, we just got home from mum and dad's and we did go into town and grab a few little things. Um, so I'm going to haul those for you guys. But I forgot to tell you about the hair straightener situation. We went to Priceline, as you would have seen, and I had a look at some of their Remington and Vidal Sassoon straighteners, and they all looked really good, but I know Target had a few good ones, but I didn't have time to go to Target. So I procrastinated, and I didn't end up buying anything. I thought I should come home and research them first, and then kind of go from there. But anyway, last night when I went to go curl my hair, I thought, oh, I'll just try the straightener again and see if it happens to turn on. And it did. And it was kind of working fine. So I swear this straightener has nine lives. I don't know what's going on with it. But I think I still need to get a new one because it is really unreliable. Like, it has a mind of its own and just decides when it wants to work. So I definitely still want to buy a new one. But I'm going to haul the things that I grabbed... First of all, I needed some new lash glue and I've been using the Kiss one. It's just the one in the white tube and it's a clear glue. And it seems to work really well. So I grabbed that. I also grabbed a new eyebrow pencil. This one's by Natio. Is that how you spell it? Natio? Natio? I don't know how you say it. And it's the angled eyebrow pencil in dark brown. I usually get blonde. Um, and I tint my eyebrows, but the lady I was talking to in Priceline said that she'd been using this one and she thought it was going to be way too dark on her, but it actually isn't. So I'm going to try this one out and see how it goes. I believe this one is an eyebrow pencil at one end and then a smudger at the other. I'm not too sure. Let's, let's open her up and have a look. Oh, so it just has a spoolie on one end. And then on the other end, it's got the product and it's retractable. Let's test out the color. Oh yeah, 
and that's the shade there so it actually isn't too dark i also stopped by mecca to grab some of my foundation oh, mecca i could literally spend a fortune in that place it's just so fun to go in there so i just got my usual one that i always wear because it doesn't break me out and it's just the estee lauder double wear in 3w1 tawny love this foundation it's so good if you have oily skin it's really good at controlling your oils throughout the day and then i also grabbed my bondi sands tan this is the aero aerated stuff tanning foam liquid gold i've been using this one for the last couple of months and i really love it it's got a really good color payoff and i find that it lasts really well on my skin i then went into cotton on and they had a sale on i think it was 30 percent off fleece so i grabbed this jumper it's just this really nice green shade it's kind of like a foresty green kind of color and it just says academy 1995 to the front and that's the logo on the back so I grabbed this one in the small. It was $49.99. I think it was down to about $35. So really good value for that. It's just a really nice, warm, cozy fleece jumper. And I really like the color of it. And I grabbed a couple of bodysuits from Dotty. They were on sale as well. They're just these Henley style bodysuits. So I grabbed a black one and a white one. And they were $39.95 down to $19.95. I grabbed them in a small. And they're just really comfy. They're so nice to just chuck on with a pair of jeans. You can wear them with trackies as well. So I'll be getting lots of wear out of them this autumn and winter. And they're actually a really nice thick kind of a ribbed fabric. And they have some good stretch in them as well. And I like that they have... A little collar to them also so you could actually wear them to work like the black one I'd probably team that up with some nice work pants and it can be a little bit more formal that way okay so for dinner tonight we're going to have quiche Lorraine you guys have probably seen this a million times it's just the Aldi quiche it's filled with ham and Australian cheese encased in a golden butter short crust base 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 pastry <laughs> pastry um so i'm gonna put that in the oven and then we're just gonna have it with some carrots and broccoli and i'm gonna pop some chips in the air fryer and that's going to be our dinner for tonight so let's get to prepping Small. 
here is dinner all done. I feel like it doesn't look like much, but it actually is really tasty and it's just such a quick and easy meal to just throw together when you don't have much time. And the kids love it, we love it, so it's just a winner. So that's going to go ahead and conclude today's video because we're going to go ahead and eat our din dins. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you all so much for watching. I love you all so very much and I look forward to seeing you all in our next video. Bye guys. Bye.